and we're rolling. Okay. Hi guys. Back at it again. I'm going to show you what's going on downstairs in our behind the scenes part two. Interesting stuff. Yeah, just a quick little message regarding we've had a couple of people kind of worried about what's going on with Bessie. Um, when you've got all of this going down, you know, she's pretty new, she's pretty new to it, so, you know, you develop whatever, whatever mechanisms you can to kind of cope with that, I guess. I'm keeping it down. So, uh, I think Queen might be doing the washing off at the moment. Let's check that out. Right, let's see what what's going down in here. Ah. This queen making the crack. Uh, washing up. For those of you saying why are you just standing there filming and not pitching in, I've tried. She just she don't take too kindly to it. Not a bad day for this sort of thing, to be honest. Get the sun streaming in, what's left of it. Like I said, you can sort of see how the house fixes stuff around us. Like these, these cornflakes weren't here yesterday. And they're, and they're just for Queen and Bessie. I don't eat nut. Can't eat nut. Yeah, as good as this place is, it doesn't really go so far as to clean stuff for us. It lets us do that itself. Much as we'd like to. But I think it's good to have that sometimes. You've got to have the boring stuff. So that the fun stuff, when it happens, is more fun. We're waiting on the fun stuff now. It's mostly just boring at the moment. I'm not even sure that smoke alarm works. Or if it even connects to anything. I damn near set the kitchen on fire once, not even a peep out of that thing. Got more noise out of our queen over here than when I did when I did that smoke alarm. Not much been on telly this week either. Best we've got is Escape to the Country, and you know how we feel about that. There's something about Kirsty Allsop, I just don't like her. Something behind her eyes. Looks like a trapped animal in there. Maybe that's why she wants to escape. Sometimes the prisons we build are more mental than physical, and sometimes the prisons we build end up costing half a million quid with attached conservatory and wine cooler and granite top kitchen island. Oh, 
I don't like escaping the country, is more the point I'm getting at. Don't seem to me to be all that uh, useful. <laughs> Forget it, you're old, you've worked 30 years, and now you're getting paroled somewhere. With a nice church spire. Sparrows around there in the evenings. And a good bird feeder that you keep topped up with pine nuts. And God knows how you complained when the cats came and started killing all the birds that were feeding around there. Believe it or not, that's how I used to live. Before this. And every day the memories of that get fainter. Like, like trying to see through somebody's neck curtains when you're outside their window. Quite a poetic description of forgetting things, I suppose, but. What's that got to do with washing up? Nothing, I think. Clearly that one wasn't up to par. Very exacting standards she's got. She broke a pint glass because I poured a beer wrong. I don't think we've forgotten about the little talk, by the way, because I haven't. Trust me, that's coming. But I think given that you're just as much part of this as anybody else, I think you deserve to see that as well. Make a house a home, and that sort of thing. Oh wait, that's just the slogan for home base. find out. If you take a look at this, Take whatever you like out of there, it's going to come back. I'm not going to starve here, that's for sure. So it goes. Just gotta keep going. Be who we are. 
because we sure as hell can't be anywhere else. 